Okay, so back again here. Uh, this wouldn't be one of my videos without me trying to hawk the squat knot. So uh, we're all familiar with this by now if you've been on site for a bit. And one of the great applications for this is to be able to carry the barrel, lower your center of gravity a little bit, and use a little bit more weight. So you're not as likely to topple over. Now, some of the torques are a little bit different on your back, but you're still able to uh, get a good solid grip on it. So as we've seen before, to attach the squat knot to anything, kettlebell handle, barbell, what have you, put the, uh, the loop end through, open it up, and then grab the knot end and pull it tight, and that's gonna lock it into place. So have one on the other side, have the water in my barrel. And what I'm gonna do now is to add a little bit more of a, uh, like a compression component, a little bit of chest squeeze, I'm gonna to try to carry with the squat knots pulled in. So it's gonna take a lot of effort to keep my hands in that position while the barrel's up. So I'll do a couple of steps like that, just to give you an idea, back up a bit. And uh, you'll see what I mean. So I'm picking it up, now I try to hold my hands in, and it's very difficult for me to do this. It's hard to keep your hands in this position. But the goal is to try to keep the knots together. I'm already shaking, there's not much weight on here. In, drop it down if it's too hard. Dump a little weight. Carry on. And then change progression and I can pull it, pull it back using my upper back to hold everything tight and just continue on my waddle. So it's one of those things where you get a feel for it, you know, what you like to do, what you don't like to do. I mean, it is a barrel full of water. You'll get wet if you fill it up a lot. They sell all different size barrels. I'm sure you're not, not new to that theory. So I just use these because they're a good size for me and I have a pile of them. But if you, um, if you come up with anything great, you start using these and you find some new things, please send me the video. I'd like to put it on. There's really a lot of different ways you can drag a barrel. Again, squat knot, loop side through, knot side through the loop. You could even carry them off to the side like this. Again, though, that's a that's a washy way to go. You're better off solid trash on that method. All right, so again, that's the squat knots in the barrel, Mike in the barrel. Uh, hope to see you soon. Take care.